The ceremony at Olpezeta Rhino Memorial Conservancy site was attended by people from all walks of life. Here, Sudan's memorial stone was unveiled. Besides that of Sunni, the second last male northern white rhino on earth who died in 2014 and among other rhinos, most of which have died at the hands of poachers. A parade was arranged by the KWS Rangers and the Rhino Caregivers with the Kenyan and Czech Republic flags hoisted in honor of the fallen rhino. Officials gathered saying wildlife conservation is a collective responsibility. This heritage is not about the government. This heritage is not about tourists coming and watching animals. This heritage is ours to preserve and us as a people must benefit. Heartfelt tributes were conveyed by caregivers about Sudan, an animal that had become an ambassador for rhino conservation initiatives. We need to open our eyes. We can't circumvent around the truth that it is because of us that these animals are near extinction. And so we hope that uh, this brief ceremony serves to galvanize attention to what could go wrong, what will go wrong if we do nothing. Nain and Fatu are the only remaining female northern white rhinos hosted at the Old Pejeta Conservancy. The only hope of saving the species is the in vitro fertilization technique. The Old Pejeta Conservancy has called upon donors to chip in to facilitate the process which will cost $9 million. It is meant to keep the species from vanishing completely. The chances of it happening are extremely small and it is likely that this species will eventually probably go extinct. However, despite plenty of criticism from some quarters, we believe that it's something that is worth trying. As a means of ending poaching and eventually avoiding such extinction, the government is keen on putting in place harsh punishment for those caught causing harm to the animals. We are going to change our laws. Anybody who is caught with ivory or killing wildlife will be jailed for life. Sudan's remains will now be preserved as government property to be used in future for educational purposes in a museum. This headstone erected in memory and honor of Sudan will now serve as a constant reminder to the future generations of the importance of wildlife conservation and the reality of extinction. Milita Oletenges, NTV at the Old Pejeta Conservancy in Lekipia County.